After the war, I went back to New York. A- after the war, I went back to New York. I finished up my studies and I practiced law. I practiced law, Burr worked next door. Even though we started at the very same time, Alexander Hamilton began to climb. How to account for his rise to the top? Man, the man is non-stop. Gentlemen of the jury, I'm curious. Bear with me. Are you aware that we're making history? This is the first murder trial of our brand new nation, the liberty behind a liberation. I intend to prove beyond a shadow of a doubt with my assistant counsel. Co counsel, Hamilton, sit down. Their client Levy weeks of innocence. Call your first witness. That was all you had to say. Okay, one more thing. Why do you assume you're the smartest in the room? Why do you assume you're the smartest in the room? Why do you assume you're the smartest? in the room. Soon that attitude may be your day. Oh, why do you write like you're running out of time? Right day and night like you're running out of time. Every day you fight like you're running out of time. Keep on fighting in the meantime. Non-stop. Corruption's such an old song that we can sing along in harmony and nowhere is it stronger than in Albany. This colony's economy is increasingly stalling and honestly that's why public He's service just needs to get non I practice a lot. I practically perfected it. I've seen injustice in the world and I've corrected it. Now for a strong controlled democracy, if not, then I'll be soccer be throwing verbal rocks at these mediocrities. Uh, Hamilton at the Constitutional Convention. I was chosen for the Constitutional Convention. There as a New York junior delegate. Now what I'm gonna say may sound indelicate. Uh, Chosen proposes his own form of government. What? His own plan for a new form of government. What? Talks for six hours, the convention is listless. Right, young man. Yo, who the F is this? Why do you always say what you believe? Why do you always say what you believe? Every proclamation guarantees free ammunition for your enemies. Uh, why do you write like you're going out of style? Right day and night like it's going out of style. Every day you fight like it's going out of style. Do what you do. Alexander. Alan Burr, sir. Well, it's the middle of the night. Can we confirm, sir? Is this a legal matter? Yes, and it's important to me. What do you mean? Burr, you're a better lawyer than me. Okay. I know I talk too much. I'm abrasive. You're incredible in court. You're synced, persuasive. My client needs a strong defense. Here's some solution. Who's your client? New U.S. Constitution. No. Hear me out. No A way. series of essays anonymously published defending the document to the public. No one will read it. I disagree. And if it fails? Burr, that's why we need it. This constitution's a mess. So it needs amendments. It's full of contradictions. So is independence. We have to start somewhere. No. No way. You're making a mistake. Good night. What are you waiting for? What do you stall for? What? We won the war. What was it all for? Do you support this constitution? Of course. Then defend it. And what if you're backing the wrong horse? Burr, we studied and we fought and we killed for the notion of a nation we now get to build. For once in your life, take a stand with pride. I don't understand how you stand to the side. I'll keep all my plans close to my chest. Wait for it, wait for it. I am sailing off to London. I am accompanied by someone who always pays. I have found a wealthy husband who will keep me in comfort for all my days. He is not a lot of fun, but there is no one who can match you for turn of phrase. My Alexander. Alexander joins forces with James Madison and John Jay to write a series of essays defending the new United States Constitution entitled The, the Federalist, Federalist Papers. Papers. The plan was to write a single of 25 essays, the work divided evenly among the three men. In the end, they wrote 85 essays in the span of six months. John Jay got sick after writing five. James Madison wrote 29. Hamilton wrote the other 51. How do you write like you're running out of time? Write day and night like you're running out of time. Every day you fight like you're running out of time. Like you're running out of time. Are you running out of time? How 
How do you ride like tomorrow won't arrive? How do you ride like you needed to survive? How do you ride every second you're alive? Every second you're alive, every second you're alive. Sir, do you want me to run the Treasury or the State Department? Treasury. Let's go. Alexander. I have to leave. Alexander. Look around, look around at how lucky we are to be alive right now. Helpless. They're asking me to leave. Look around. 